Okay friends, this uh, small video is about the quantitative preparation for the CAT and I am going to talk about how to uh, make a self-study strategy uh, for the quantitative CAT. Okay, uh, I am taking some online classes on Wizik, you can check those out, uh, it's like a two hour regular class daily uh, divided into a one hour each, so like two classes daily and five hour max extreme class on the Saturdays and Sundays. Now the presentation like the one which you are watching are uploaded on my website, uh, you can download it from there and you need the books uh, with you. Okay, now uh, for the quantitative CAT I have uh, two books that I would like to recommend you. First is the quantitative aptitude for the CAT and second is the quantum CAT. Now for the strategy and the targets, uh, you know if, if you are going for uh, the most perfect game then you should solve 100% of either one of these books and uh, you have to develop uh, a strategy and understanding of each and every topic from its root and uh, uh, in an in-depth discussion of all areas and touching like the toughest level is quite important because in, in the exam we'll have like three questions the first is the sitters the second are the time takers uh, Either we have to leave the time takers or we have to do it at a 50-50. So uh, depending on the distribution, we have to uh, pick the setters, uh, make some uh, or devise some strategy for the time takers so that reduce it to as many uh, meaningful options as you can. So it, it's, it's really important that you should cover each and every area that's uh, in the exam. Okay, the motivation is... Uh, an important factor here so you need to keep yourself motivated now in, in this series I am going to talk only on level 2 and level 3 questions I expect you to do the level 1 yourself of course you can bring the questions in the doubt uh, uh, in the doubt uh, classes so uh, the level 2 level 3 questions are like a little bit tricky ones and uh, I plan to take all questions live in the classes and uh, what what important here what's the part which is quite important here is that you need to have alternate strategies so if if you have like some questions which you can do 100% right you need to have some questions where you can really reduce down to options and eliminate some of the options and each question like if you were to do if you you must have the uh, tools with you to do it like 100% uh, right in two and a half minutes say around uh, 80 percent probability of getting in right in two minutes a 50 50 in like 40 seconds or uh, you know a probability of over uh, one by four if you have four options so a probability of around 40 percent in 30 seconds so these are the kind of distributions that you can take in of course in the ideal case you would like to do all the questions but uh, in the first go you need to search uh, the sitter so the 50-50 concept is also going to play an important role. So th that would be one part that we'll be discussing in level 2 and level 3. Now uh, there have been lots of formulas in, in the course and you sometimes think that uh, or oh, how you are going to remember all those things. So doing it without dependencies of the formula is another thing that I'll be talking about that if you don't know the formula uh, take another 40 seconds or 50 seconds to derive it and do the questions. Uh, that should not be done taking into consideration we have got a very 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 less time in the exam so but in other case we should have the formula the questions done by intuition rather than a lot of formulas so let's take a case of this book it's a uh, it's the quantum cat by Arihant publications by the author Sarvesh Kumar and for example the ratio proportion has uh, questions divided into three level uh, it has like 49 questions in level 2 and 16 questions in level 3 which, which can be done in like 4 classes or a target 4 hours uh, taking into consideration that we do like 15 to 20 questions. Okay, And the percentage again in quantum cat is uh, divided into 3 levels uh, around 50 questions in each level a target of 5 classes profit loss and discount a target of 4 classes set theory in a target of 2 classes. Uh, so in totality this book has around like 1500 questions at level 1, 1500 questions at level 2 and 1000 questions at level 3. Uh, I have made some approximations here because some of the questions are like just repeated even in level 2, level 3. So uh, if we target a question of like 15 to 20 in a 1 hour class, of course a 1 hour class is not a strict 1 hour class, it might get extended 
like one and a half hours or it might end in one hours so th that's uh, just a target time so uh, we can actually do the syllabus in like 120 to 130 classes to talk about 100 percent uh, of level 2 and level 3 of this book so that's what uh, seems to be a plausible strategy if, if you were to take a daily class uh, it would take like three or four months uh, if, if we include the max extreme classes and the doubt clearing classes then it might take uh, around 30 months taking into consideration the five hour classes on Saturdays and Sundays so if, if you have like a max extreme class on alternative Sundays or things like that then you can probably plan out this book uh, in three months in this live online class so this was all about uh, a strategy for the uh, quantitative part of the CAT. I hope you liked my video. Uh, if you have any uh, comments or any suggestion, you can email me at shivgantri at the red gmail dot com and my website is free gregmatclass dot com. Thank you for watching this recording. Best of luck for your.